why I also found food insecurity is throughout the whole entire world and the main leading factor is due to drought. So romaine lettuce is grown throughout almost every region throughout the world. It's very a sustainable, healthy crop. So what I did was I found that potassium is a supplement in many fertilizers and what it does is it helps enlarge the plant's root system to allow them to take up water. So I had two hydroplant systems, so I, I did two trials and I had different lettuce in both the hydroplant systems. And in one of the hydroplant systems, I had potash. So potash is like a granular compound of potassium. It's just really concentrated potassium. And then in both the hydroplant systems, I had fertilizer with no potash. And then in the one with potash, I found that there was a 180.8% increase in the plant's growth. Winter Haven, Florida. Okay. I work for the city of Winter Haven in natural resources. We have a list of questions depending on if it's biological or chemical or engineering, and we make sure that their projects are relevant both to science today and also appropriate for their grade level of course and help encourage them to just have a passion for stuff. The effects and aesthetic qualities of sound produced from different types of strings. Um, the reason we picked this is because we're all musicians and we wanted to, if we were going to do a project, we wanted it to kind of match our interests. So we wanted to do something that had to, something involved with sound. So our leading question, does the type of string used on a guitar impact string bending? So what is string bending, right? String bending on a guitar is uh, changing the frequency by changing the tension you put on the string. On the fourth fret, under this fret, and then we had the guitar string bend to the um, pitch E4 which is our control, and then we measure the displacement of the change position and the original position of the string. So what did you find out? I found out that this is one more mile an hour better than the titanium driver. Okay. But uh, when I did the uh, data, there I was swinging at the same rate and all that, and they're pretty much the same driver. It's just that this one's tiny bit better. Okay. And that's the titanium? Or is that that's the that's the, the carbon? Okay. Which is more expensive, carbon or titanium? Okay. So all right. So I see you've got the picture there using the monitor there. Was that uh, at home? Or is that at your like where you where you where you practice? Well, uh, no, that's a local golf shop. Okay. And when I moved here around eight years ago, I was a bit shocked as they weren't as common here. 
it made me wonder if there really was any science behind it, or if it was like the pseudoscience all along that I have been believing. But I conducted this research and it made me like really reconnect with my younger self and really like I feel my younger me would be very proud. Thank you.